So this video is uh, to show you a really easy way to change the 12 inch drive shaft uh, to a 4 inch drive shaft. Um, you can see if we look a little bit more closely it has kind of this rounded end, it has a chamfer on the edges um, and um, so if we just like cut off one end of it we would lose the feature there and we don't want to have to recreate that so if we look at the uh, uh, if we just work up our way through the tree, I can see I drag that up. So this was just mirrored about one end, right? And if I take away the cut revolve, that was actually on this end here. I'll put that back just for a second here, right? That was the cut revolve. If we look at the, the way that was done, you can see there was a little sketch there to round that off. Um, and... Then we I'll go past the axis, and if I go past the cut extrude, you can see that takes away that, that chamfer on the end. So now we just have basically a square shaft. And if I look at that sketch, um, it's uh, there's the, the, the side dimensions, and if I click on the boss, you can see. So the way this was made, it was just extrude a, basically a six inch, a square, uh, an eighth inch square, six inches, and then work on one end, and then just do a mirror. So now that we understand how it was made, um, if we just uh, edit this feature right here, instead of six, if we want a four inch, we'll just make it uh, two inches. Okay, if I can get this to work, what's wrong with this? Okay, two. Okay, and now if we just add back the rest of the work. You can see that we have the chamfers back, we have this rounded end on both ends right so that's just just by changing that one thing um, I also could have just not even opened that feature up just click on this and you can see there's the two uh, that would have been six before if I just double click on that and change it to two then I would have been done that way as well so anyways that's just a, a fast and easy way to change um, from a 12 inch shaft to a 4 inch shaft but still without losing cutting off these features on the end.